The San Luis Obispo County Clerk Recorder just certified the primary election results this afternoon. After several weeks of busy work behind the scenes, the numbers are final. KSBY News reporter Claudia Buzio has more on those certified election results. Despite an initial low early voting turnout, more than 88,000 ballots were processed in San Luis Obispo County. Some candidates are now preparing for the midterm elections in November. The primary election numbers were updated one last time on July 7th, 2022 at 9.57 a.m. I will be signing the certification of election results, gathering all the required documentation that needs to accompany that certification and sending it up to the Secretary of State's office. This comes after weeks of carefully reviewing ballots. Waiting for all of the cure letters to come in for those uh, voters that needed uh, to update their signature that didn't match on their vote by mail envelope. Some races closer than others. Jimmy Paulding won the District 4 supervisor election with 51.5% of the votes of beating incumbent District 4 Supervisor Lynn Compton by 639 votes. I had a journey, um, you know, going all the way back to 2018 when I previously ran for this office. Uh, what I learned on the campaign trail was that the top issues to, um, that, that matter to people in District 4 in South County are primarily um, water. They want to make sure we have reliable sources of water for the future in light of our continued drought. I reached out to Compton but did not hear back from her by the time of this newscast. Another race garnering attention is for District 2 Supervisor, which is moving on to the November election. Incumbent District 2 Supervisor Bruce Gibson received 47% of the vote, while Dr. Bruce Jones got nearly 19%. Three conservative candidates together got 52.5% roughly. Um, I think going into the election, I can expect that most conservatives that voted for one of these three candidates will vote for me. I think I actually have a better feeling for what matters to people. In a statement, Gibson said in part, quote, the results are within the range I expected. While it would have been nice to win outright in June, our campaign is already geared up and excited to campaign to November. There is one last step to call this primary election. July 19th, I will be bringing before the board the certification of the election, and at that time they will be able to declare the results. If there is a recount request, it would have to come in, in the next five days. If that doesn't happen, then these results are final. In the studio, Claudia Busio, KSBY News. The San Luis Obispo County Clerk Recorder's Office says nominations for the November midterm elections will begin on July 18th.